There is nothing like visiting a golf course like the Foxton Golf Club. It's like unearthing a well-known hidden gem. We arrived to a warm welcome from over 45 members and were greeted by the club's president, John Davis. As you'd expect, the locals excited to showcase their course. Welcome to Foxton. Foxton has plenty of local charm and is in every sense a best kept secret. It's a short but demanding golf course and it boasts an extensive history of members enjoying their golf here. It was first established in um, 1949 as a 12 hole golf course in a style that um, is totally different today. It was basically back to front. And from there it developed and to the late 70s when they made it into an 18 hole golf course. And in the early 90s we put fairway watering in and hence we've ended up with what we've got today. Foxton is a fantastic all-weather golf course and its free draining makes it popular with visitors. It has its own point of difference. We are actually classed as a Lynx course in a park-like surroundings because we have the best of both worlds. We have the sand so everything drains away. We've hardly ever closed because of bad weather. But we have the trees that jump out and bite you as well. I know it's a well-used fact that everyone says we've got the hidden gem, but we really have. We are never close, we have no booking times, and if you turn up, we'll even make way for you to get on. Many visitors are humbled by the challenge at Foxton. It is no pushover. Oh, it's always difficult to play out of the trees. They've grown quite a bit. I've been overseas for the past 10 years of my life, so to come back here and see the whole place change, the trees growing, it's, a, it's tough. We begin our course tour with Junior at the second. Uh, number two is a par four, it's our stroke hole number one. It's a dog leg left. You pretty much want to hit it down the right hand side to give you a good shot into the green for your second shot. If you go left, you're in trouble. Pretty much bogey's on, so you just want to stay right. But let's see how we go. There are plenty of nerves, but Junior is safely down the middle. Well, it seems like a pretty good start. Let's go and see if we can get the second one on the green. Let's go, team. We soon discover that it's the people at Foxton who make it a special place to play golf. OK, here we are. I've probably gone a little bit further than I wanted, but I'm just sitting in a little light rough. And it's not too far to the hole left, one about 120 metres. And I think a pitching wedge is a good, good club for here. Hey, Rog, give me the pitching wedge. Thanks, mate. Junior hits a good approach to the second. Well, the biggest danger for the second shot is if you hit it left, he's got that gully there. It's tough to play from out of there, so I'm quite happy with that shot. I'll take that. Well, this is a nice green. It slopes from back to front, and I'm hopefully I can hold this putt. I've got a good uphill putt, so let's give it a go. It may have been playing in front of a gallery, but sadly Junior missed the early birdie chance. But he can tap in for an easy par on the hardest hole in the course. We move on to the par 5 fifth. This hole is a favourite among the members. It is very forgiving. Because it's got its name, the canal, it has a bank on either side. So as long as you don't go over the top of that, your ball will trickle back down into the middle and you have another shot. The green slopes quite badly from left to right because it goes round the bit of a hill. So if you aim left and the pin's on the right, nine times out of ten, you've got a pretty good putt. Well, now we head to the seventh where Junior has a showdown with one of the ladies' members, Lucy Williams. Naturally, Junior is a bit worried about coming second in the battle of the sexes. Lucy, a promising local talent, grabs a driver to hit to the 153-metre par three. And she comes up just shy, but it's in good shape. It's Junior's turn, and the local who aspires to play professional golf delivered a great tee shot under pressure to set up a birdie opportunity. With local bragging rights at stake here, Lucy keeps in the contest with a well-executed chip shot to the seventh. Yeah. 
Junior had the chance to take the honours with this birdie effort, but he's off target and has to settle for par. Lucy has the chance to tie the hole. And she makes no mistake. A half is a popular result for club members. Nice putt, Luz. Back at the clubhouse, it's time for lunch with the locals extending their hospitality. Brother Philip shares some of his stories from his international travels with the HSBC Golf Club. During the break, Brent White from City Chrysler Lower Hut shows the members through the latest Chrysler 300C models before we get back into the action on the 17th. OK, here we are on the 17th. It's one of our feature holes. It's a par four, dog leg left, big pine trees on the left. So what you want to do is aim down the right hand side where you see the gallery down there to give yourself a good second shot into the hole. Let's see how we go. Junior smashed his drive down the 17th. It's one of the harder driving holes at Foxton, and it's important to find the fairway. It's clear that Junior Tartanup is a handy golfing talent, and the test of the tight layout at Foxton has played an important part in shaping his game. Well, here we are on the 17th green. It's a tough green, there's lots of subtle breaks everywhere. So, touch wood, let's see if I can hold one for you. The greens at Foxton are certainly a feature. They're pure surfaces to putt on, and Junior comes so close to making birdie. He taps in for par after another well-played hole. Well, I can't get that elusive birdie, but I'll take par any day. Thanks a lot. On to the final hole. It's a short par five that presents a birdie opportunity again. Junior makes that possible when his drive ends up in the perfect position. Got about 210 metres. Got a three iron into a bit of breeze. Let's see if I can fluke one. Well, unfortunately that shot never made the green. Didn't allow enough for the win. But this looks a good opportunity to make a birdie from here. Hopefully I can do it. And Junior Tardina saves his best for last. Hey, that's more like it. Looks like it's going to be the first birdie of the day. <laughs> so Junior finishes the way we'd all like to with a birdie on 18. And the tour of this hidden jam at Foxton is complete. Hey, well finally I've made a birdie. Thank you for joining us. This is the great club, Foxton. I love it, I play here. If you're ever in the area, we're on the main road, just call on in, you'll enjoy yourself. We have great people, great food, and a great golf course. Hopefully I'll see you here. Foxton is an affordable course to play at just $20 for affiliates and $25 for non-affiliated golfers.